Hollywood's always searching for the next it girl. So instead of compiling a big top 10 list. Which is way too much hard work. Yeah, exactly. We decide to focus on one girl a week. So we present to you the starlet of the week. All right, let's get started. This week, we're gonna be profiling Dakota Johnson. I gotta say, uh, I was looking through some of the pictures of Mandatory. I can understand why she was cast in Fifty Shades of Grey. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, she's very beautiful. She's the daughter of two, you know, famous good-looking actors, Don Johnson and Melanie Griffith. So she's got the looks, right? Yeah. And she's up and coming, she's young. I don't know much about Fifty Shades of Grey, do you? I, I've never read the books. <laughs> From the things I've heard, they're very naughty. Yeah, very naughty. She's a young, <laughs> I think vulnerable girl, and I think Dakota Johnson fits that look. I've actually heard some hardcore Fifty Shades of Grey fans in the interwebs are wow. not quite happy with her hmm. because they don't feel that she fits the uh, exact physical mold of, I believe, Anastasia Steele. Anastasia Steele, that's right. But, you know, I mean, she's beautiful. They're, they're going to make her look gorgeous, yeah. even more so, for the movie. So I think everything's going to be fine. People just need to calm down a little bit. Another reason we chose Dakota Johnson is it really seems like she is a starlet on the rise. I mean, 2014, it looks like she's going to have at least three films coming out. Yeah, along with um, Fifty Shades of Grey, she'll be in Need for Speed, which is the new Aaron Paul movie, famous for playing Jesse Pinkman on Breaking Bad. Mm -hmm. So you're going to be seeing a lot of Dakota Johnson in the next year and uh, it's probably a good thing. Absolutely. I, I don't think people are gonna be complaining. Thanks for joining us. Hopefully you've enjoyed this uh, profile of Dakota Johnson as much as we have. Yeah. Uh, if you wanna see even more stills of her, check out mandatory.com. That's right, go to the girls section. We have plenty of galleries, photos, videos of these up and coming starlets. We'll see you next week. I'm not bluffing. They know, they just don't care. I don't know what happened. I was deep undercover in an investigation. You know, at the end of the day, Van Halen. Whoa, twink it down. Hold on. Five cent of rule. I got you. Okay. So, how to become Emma Stone. You born Emily Jean Stone on a golf course with balls literally flinging at your face every day. Do some local plays, be a jackass, and drop out of school. No, seriously, all it takes is one PowerPoint presentation set to Madonna's Hollywood.